the kick is up it's long and long kick right through the upright it's good the score is tied now 28 28 eight to go 68 yards it takes them 13 plays finally tj mahan mahan hits nathan butterworth with a five-yard touchdown pass david burnett kicks the extra point so with 841 left in this ball game it's 28 28. Oh, what a game we have watched here at Noakes Lassiter tonight. Here's the kickoff. Long and deep. That'll go away in the end zone. Lebanon going to let it go. That's going to hit uh, eight yards deep in the end zone. Go all the way across the track. Down to the high jump pit down there. And Lebanon will bring it out to the 20-yard line. And the Blue Doubles will put it in play at the 20 and have 80 yards to go for the go-ahead here. Tell you what, one of the better plays we've seen tonight was by the Farragut holder on the PAT. Brad Rowland as he takes a awfully high snap and somehow gets it down on the pad for the kicker. Blue Devils first and 10. C coming to the near side. Zachary to the short side, the far side. Blue Devils moving from your right to left. Tie score, 28 all. They pitch it to Stafford. Got a good hole over the 21, 22, out to the 23. And I think they're not going to give him any further than that. A gain of about three by Stafford. And the Admirals have a man getting up slowly. And that's that great middle linebacker of theirs out there. 54. Brandon Williams. Well, he's, an, he's listed as an offensive tackle. So I guess he is that offensive tackle on that side. Made a good play. Gets up awfully slow. Favoring a leg. But here come the Blue Devils. Second down, seven Lebanon. Double wide outs to the far side. That's C and Zachary to the far side. Lebanon on a long count. They give it to Stafford. Stafford got a little room over the 35. Stafford's got the first down. Out over the 31, 32-yard line. Chris Stafford blasted over the 25, over the 30, out to the 31 and a half. First down, Blue Devils. John, Stafford just kind of gets lost in that sea of blue jerseys and keeps those feet churning. He knows his blockers are in front of him, Tommy. Just bows his head and keeps on going. And tell you what, what a game Chris Stafford's had so far tonight. Lebanon first and 10. Ball at the 30. Well, call it the 31. We're almost at the 32. Call it the Lebanon 31. First down and 10 for the Blue Devils. Double wideouts. Pitt down the line. Wants to throw. Rush is on. Fires it away. Threw it away. Good play by Damon Pitt. That time he had uh, Joel Griffin in the vicinity, but uh, he was running out of real estate, and Rodgers came through on that great uh, linebacker blitz and almost pinned him back at the 20, and Pitt threw it away wisely. John, how does Joel Griffin look to you? You're down there on the field with him. How does, how does it look like he's moving? Tommy, he, he walks and runs a little gingerly, still uh, still not sure. You know, when you go through a knee surgery like that, you don't know exactly what you're able to do. So, uh, and, and, it, and it's showing in Joel tonight. Second down, 10 for Lebanon. Three wide outs to the far side, one to the near side. Pitt back to throw. Here comes the rush. And almost intercepted. We that big offensive tackle, or the linebacker, number 52, almost intercepted that one on the screen. Lebanon had it set up well, but didn't get the pass arched enough over the incoming rush. Lebanon trying to set the middle screen for Ron C. We had the no bats package. Everybody running the fly routes, trying to run the defensive backfield off. We did that, but the defensive line gets a hand up and very nearly intercepts that football. All right, seven and a half minutes to play. 28-28 here at Noakes Laster. C comes wide to the near side. Short side is Zachary. Pitt looks third down and 10. Lebanon. Pitt. And here's Zachary. Loose football. Zachary going to have to get Oh, They're going to pick it up and run it all the way in. Farragut picks it up at the 20 as Lebanon didn't fall on it. Zachary trying to pick it up instead of covering it at the 20. And Farragut goes on top. 34 28 with 722 remaining. Lebanon trying the reverse, the trick play, and it looked like we had some yardage on the near sideline. Zachary bobbles the handoff, doesn't get down on it quickly, and Farragut quickly picks it up and runs it in. The Admirals trying to get an extra player onto the field, and they may wind up taking the delay here. As they, as they set their PAT team. They're in very much disarray right now. They lost the ball for a second, Tommy. Bartison will be in to do the long snapping once again. Roland to handle the snap. Burnett to kick. Roland's a guy that had that high snap brought down last time. It's a good snap this time. The kick is up. It's long enough, and he puts it through. So 
Knoxville Farragut goes up 35-28. Plenty of time to go. Seven minutes, 22 seconds to go in this ball game. This sideline report. Ari Spence picks up a fumble and returns it 17 yards for a Farragut touchdown. David Bar Burnett kicks the extra point. So with 7.22 left in the ball game, Farragut now leads Lebanon 35-28. Farragut penalized five. They're going to have to... That's uh, a personal foul after the extra point, Clyde. So that's a 15-yarder. 15 15-yarder. 15 They're going to kick it from the 25. So Lebanon gets a big break right there. Here comes Burnett. He's forward a long kick. Zachary going to chase it, and it's going to go into the end zone. A great job by Farragut as he goes into the end zone. And Lebanon will bring it out to the 20-yard line. And the Blue Devils have got a drive facing them. They've got to go 80 to tie this thing. And a great kick. You can't uh, say enough about the kicking game tonight for Farragut. The long kickoff, keeping Lebanon hemmed up and feel in poor field position. We're starting at our own 20 once again. First and 10 Blue Devils at their own 20. Here they come out of the huddle. C coming wide to the near side. Zachary to the short side. Pitts the quarterback. Reeves the fullback. And Stafford is the tailback. Lebanon underneath. Pitt wants to throw. Looks. Got to get rid of it. Pitt hit. Gets outside. And he's going to be called for intentional ground in there. Finally threw it away, but it's going to be an intentional ground, and that may be better than being dropped at the six-yard line. Well, uh, Damon, if he saw a blue jersey, it was one of our managers on the sideline. Damon flushed out of the pocket. We were trying to hit Ron on the, uh, looks like the curl and go route or maybe the slant and go and nothing open and here came the rush on him he just started retreating and the penalty mark off is going to go against the Blue Devils and it's going to be from the spot that he was down so it's going to put the Blue Devils back at the three yard line their own three yard line and loss of down and loss of down it will be second down now and 20 at least 25 for the Blue Football is at the three. They've got to go past the 20. 23 yards to go. They've got to go past the 30 for the first down. Blue Devils. Pitt. Pitch back to throw. Here is Hankins behind everybody. Hankins oh. almost got it. He got a hand on it up at the 35-yard line as they pitched it to Zachary. And Zachary threw for Hankins. And Hankins almost made a great play. He got his hands on it at the 35, but he was all stretched out and could not get to it. It is third down now and 25. Hey, that's a gutsy call by the Lebanon coaching staff that very nearly worked for a big play. We get Zachary back there at tailback, and they run the toss sweep look to him, and he comes up and throws the football to Hankins. Just incomplete, and man, oh, man, that would have been such a great play. 35-28, Lebanon on the short end, and the Blue Devils going to have to... Now they're going to be penalized again for too much time. It'll be delay, and it's going to cost them a yard and a half. That'll put the ball back at the one-and-a-half yard line. Well, from there, that's not really... Not, not that a lot. much difference, no. When you're backed up inside your own five, half the distance doesn't make a lot of difference. And, John, that was a good-looking play, that, that uh, halfback pass from Zachary outside. That's right, Tommy. It almost worked. Would have been a huge play. That was not a delay of game call. We were trying to get our uh, tight end, Elliot Carson, out of the game. Instead of going off the field laterally, he come across and cut across the line of scrimmage, which that's uh, offsides. All right, so Lebanon penalized. Triple wide outs for the Blue Devils, and Pitt back to throw. Big rush. He fires. He's got his man, Hankins, and they knock it loose up at the six-yard line. We were trying to run the hitch and pitch, the uh, the hook and lateral play with Hankins catching the ball and flipping it back to Chris Stafford. The uh, the defensive back came up and made the play on Hankins, so Bob Dillard pulling out the entire playbook tonight, and now Tressler will kick it from back of his, the back of our end zone as Farragut's going to probably get the football in great field position. Farragut going to stop at their own. They're going to have their deep men at their own 30 at Lebanon 35 yard line. Here is Tressler's kick and it's a long lazy spiral. It's going to hit and take a Lebanon bounce hit over the 30 roll over the 40. Keep rolling on up to the 49 yard line or 48 yard line. Turns out to be a fairly decent kick by Lebanon. 
as Farragut couldn't get it. It was over on the near sideline, and Farragut will take over at the Lebanon 48-yard line, first and 10, and the Blue Devil defense must hold now. Terry, what about that kick from the senior Todd Tressler? Nice kick by Todd as he gets the advantage of kicking end over end and getting the big bounce from the Lebanon 2 out to their 48, 46-yard punt by Tressler. First and 10, Farragut at the Lebanon 48-yard line. Mahan, the quarterback, hands off to Dixon, and Dixon is down for a loss. They may give him back to the line of scrimmage. He got there, but on second effort, Lebanon dumps him back in uh, Farragut territory, but they give him his where his original effort was. Looked like Lucas hit him right off the bat and he starts that spin move, and he spins right into the arms of Elliot Carson. Second down, 11, Farragut at the Lebanon 49. They lost a yard on the play. Double wide out, shotgun formation. Mahan with the snap, and they give it to Dixon, and here he comes, roars down over the 48, over the 46 to the 45, near the 45-yard line. It'll bring up a third down and a long seven to go at the Lebanon 41. John, what's the feel on that sideline? We still got some emotion down there? Got plenty of emotion, Tommy. This is a huge play right here. It's third and long. If the Blue Devils can hold them right here, we've scored quickly tonight in a couple of drives, so we can score again. 5.33 to play. 35-28. They lead us by seven. Mahan looks. Look, got all day. Fires long. Kressler's back there, and it's off the hands of both and goes out of bounds. Rudy Smith down there jumping with Tressler, and Tressler got the best of it that time as they tip it out of bounds, and it'll bring up fourth down now for Farragut. John, did you see Smith pointing at uh, at uh, Tressler? They apparently felt like they, when they got Todd in single coverage, they were going to go at him. Look that away, Tommy, and the whole sideline over here was helping Todd out when that ball <laughs> got in the air. We. We were all hollering for him to turn around. Here it comes, and he got there and, and made the play. Burnett back at his own 41. Low snap, got time. Gets it off, end over end. Tressler going to call for and make a fair catch at the 11-yard line. And Lebanon will put it in play at that point. The Blue Devils have to go 89 yards for a tie here. Terry, what about the kick from Burnett? Line of scrimmage, the 45. Tressler makes the fair catch at the 11. 34-yard punt, no return. Lebanon takes over on their own 11. 5.15 left in this ballgame. Blue Devils have got time. Five minutes, 15 seconds. It's all up to the offense right here if they can dig it out and gut it out and get it down the field. Double wideouts for the Blue Devils. Set formation in the eye. The pitch is back and the throw. Here's Carson. He's got it. 15. Carson out to the 19-yard line. A gain of about eight on first down. A great first down play as Lebanon comes out throwing and Carson gets eight on a pit pass out to the 19-yard line. John, that right ankle's really bothering Elliot Carson. That hurt his knee that time, Tommy. He took a helmet right in that left knee. So uh, Elliot's really bummed up, and uh, but still doing the job for the Blue Devils at that tight end position. Lebanon trying to get out of the hole here. Second down and a short two for the Blue Devils. Hand off, they give it to Stafford, and Stafford's got the first down. Steps across the 20, out over the 21, to the 22, to the 23-yard line goes Stafford. It's first down, Blue Devils, from that point. 4.34 to play here in the football game. We're trailing Knoxville Fair, get 35-28. Terry, what about Chris running the football? Tommy, 22 carries tonight for Chris, 166 yards. Lebanon goes with a double wideout formation once again. First down and 10 for the Blue at their own 23-yard line. Pitt wants to throw. Got time. Fires long. And here is Zachary, but the pass is wide. Zachary had his man beat by about three yards, but the pass this time a little bit off target by Pitt. Or guys, that one may have been on the scoreboard. Trying to hit uh, Zachary on the fade route or maybe the deep flag toward the Farragut sideline and the pass overthrown a little bit. And it looked like Zachary may have got bumped off on his uh, pass route. He might have got held up at the line of scrimmage. Second down 10, Blue Devils at their own 23-yard line. Double wide outs to the wide side. Lebanon in that unbalanced line to the left. And Pitt back to throw, got some time. Looks, now being flushed, fires over the middle. Ron C has got it up at the 32-yard line. Great catch by C. He had him all 